have in front of me here a twist on uh, BNC connector for use with RG59 cable. Okay, so the idea of uh, big advantage of this is that you don't need any crimping tool or anything like this. You can just pare down the RF, uh, RG59 cable and twist the, uh, the cable on and you get a good connection. Now the key point to note for this is, if we look here, there's already a pin in location here. So what will actually happen is, when we twist down and push through the copper cable, or the cable in and twist it into location, the actual exposed copper wire, when it gets to the very top of the housing here, will actually push open sort of two little gates that are making the connection and work its way in and that's how we ensure we get good connection and the, the, the copper wire from the cable is actually just inside the pin that's exposed here. So what we're going to do here is I'm just going to start off, we have to know how much cable to pair back so roughly the length of the barrel is what we're going to cut off. So what we'll do here is we'll come along and we'll just get this and we'll twist it around like this. Get my snips. All right, they're in here. Now what we can do is, it's probably a little bit excessive here. What I'll do is I'll just snip off the extra outside braiding here, a bit more than I need. Like that. But the next thing then is to cut down the top part of the dielectric like this, just to expose the central core wire. Next thing here is to actually come along, just slide this into position here. What we do then is we just move it down along and we just twist it repeatedly until we lock it tightly into position then. We can see it here. So now we're actually we've come along here and we can see here that we have to put on the B and C twist on connection here. Now just as by way of demonstration on the far end of the BNC here, or of the, of the cable here, the RG59 cable here, we have an actual crimp on RG59 that I put on at an earlier point. Um, that's a more secure way of putting on a connector, uh, but the disadvantage of it is you do actually need a tool and things like that. So, you know, if you're doing it on a professional level, continuously putting on BNC cables, you'll nearly always obviously use a crimp on thing, but if you only just need a few connectors put it on, then the twist on BNC can be an acceptable solution as well. It's part of a wider range of connectors, um, adapters, splitters, and um, RG59 cable, etc., that we have available on the TV Trade.ie website.